there was this individual that would go from the city. He would go from the city. He would drive his vehicle to a place called a cave. Now, the cave was literally a cave, right? What this person didn't know as, as he was kept going, right, from the city, he was making these trips. At first, they were, in the beginning, they were, they were very freak. They were not, they were low in value. But as time went on, he, it was, it became more, more trips. The vehicles changed, right? different types of vehicles. Eventually, he was actually in this cave. And what this, this person didn't know, he was actually being, he was surrounding himself within this cave. In other words, this cave was caving in on him. The cave was caving in on him. But this person didn't see it. It was almost like he was building a little prison for uh, for whatever. So he's back and forth, eventually loses the vehicle. Now he's down to uh, maybe a motorcycle and then eventually to a bicycle. And here's the individual now. Will anyone find him? Uh, he, 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 the very last that he was even heard of, he was on a bicycle. Nobody knew where he was going. He, she, nobody knew. Made it to the, to the cave. As I mentioned earlier, what this man, what this person didn't know was that it was caving in on him. He was building his own prison. And eventually, eventually he fell into that trap. Now, stay with me here. We're going to be ending very soon. I just want you to reflect on what I'm sharing with you here. Just please reflect. Watch this video again if necessary. What was that man going through inside that cave? You know, if you're in a cave and you're like in a prison type place where there is no more door, there's no more window. Your desperation, something begins to happen to you as a human being. I know people talk about claustrophobia, being shut in. There's some really, really strange experiences that, that begin to take place in the, in, the, in the mind. In the mind first, and then it begins to travel to the emotion. The emotional, it'll wreck you if, if it gets to the emotional area. Man, I, I, I just, I, I can't fathom if you can just think with me. It, the person's not going to live very long, first of all, in a cave, right? Not going to live very long because uh, how, how long can you live within a, a, sealed con, a, a sealed container, a sealed prison without any windows, without any outside world? W what about no food, no drink? You can only last so long in there. You can only last so long inside that place. The desperation will, will just grow and grow. And eventually we know what will happen if that individual stays inside. We know what will happen. Eventually we know the ultimate, the, the ultimate result. Right? In life you have two types. You have the positive result of something. You have the negative result. But you're getting feedback. Everything that's coming at you is giving you feedback. It's giving you a result. Now I'm going to end here. I just want you to leave a comment and think about what I just shared. If anything matters to you, if this has not been a divine appointment, then I know that you're not going to leave a comment. Nothing matters. You'll go on. But I want to serve you on the other side and I want to support you in your quest if. I want to support you if you're willing to support yourself. Coaching is available. Mentoring is available one-on-one -on -one if you qualify. Other than that, SciTech, the podcast on Sundays, these live videos, and whenever I may go live. Who knows? Maybe I'll do a boot camp, a two-day a two boot camp live where we go live and we talk about these things and we really interact camera to camera. That may be coming soon. 
With that said, I'll see you at the top on the inside on my very next one, making every day super fantastic, terrific, and over the top. Peace comes through strength, my friend. And remember, your good life is going to come out of a good series of good, constant, positive reminders.